In the course of that night, however, Jacob arose, took his two wives with the two maidservants and his eleven children, and crossed the ford of the Jabbok. After he had taken them across the stream and had brought over all his possessions, Jacob was left there alone. Then some man wrestled with him until the break of dawn. When the man saw that he could not prevail over him, he struck Jacob's hip at its socket so that the hip socket was wrenched as they wrestled. The man then said, Let me go, for it is daybreak. But Jacob said, I will not let you go until you bless me. What is your name? The man asked. He answered, Jacob. Then the man said, You shall no longer be spoken of as Jacob, but as Israel, because you have contended with divine and human beings and have prevailed. Jacob then asked him, do tell me your name, please. He answered, Why should you want to know my name? With that, he bade him farewell. Jacob named the place Peniel. Because I have seen God face to face, he said, yet my life has been spared. At sunrise, as he left Pinuel, Jacob limped along because of his hip. That is why to this day the Israelites do not eat the sciatic muscle that is on the hip socket, inasmuch as Jacob's hip socket was struck at the sciatic muscle. Mm -hmm.